Different kinds of skeleton. Unit 1.4. The first type of skeleton is an exoskeleton. An exoskeleton is the rigid covering found on the exterior of many animals, such as a crab. Identification key. An identification key is a tool to assist a user identify an organism. It guides the user along a path towards an identification. It basically helps us identify the given organism by asking ourselves simple questions. Invertebrates, an animal lacking a backbone. Vertebrate, an animal of a large group distinguished by the possession of a backbone or spinal column including mammals, birds, reptiles, amphibians, and fishes. Vertebrates are birds, fish, reptile, amphibians like frog, and a lion. Animals with bones. They have a skeleton with backbone inside their bodies. These are called vertebrates. The word vertebrate means with a bone. Vertebrates are sorted into five groups. The first group is a fish. Fishes are vertebrates that live in water. They have fins instead of arms and legs. Their bodies are covered with scales. Amphibians such as frogs live in water and on land. Their bodies are covered with smooth, wet skin. Reptiles such as snakes, lizards, and tortoises are covered with dry scales. Some reptiles live on land, some reptiles live in water. For example, crocodile. Birds are covered with feathers. Birds have wings instead of arms. Most birds can fly. Some birds like ostrich cannot fly. Mammals are covered with hair or fur. Some mammals live on land, some mammals live in the sea. For example, whale and dolphin. These are mammals and they live in the sea. Animals without bones. Some animals have no bones. Animals with no bones are called invertebrates. The word invertebrate means without a backbone. Some invertebrate animals have hard skin or shells on the outside of their bodies. This hard outer layer is called exoskeleton. Other invertebrate animals such as jellyfish have soft bodies. These animals do not have exoskeleton. Identification keys Scientists use identification keys to help them sort and identify objects, materials, and living things. Identification keys are based on questions that can be answered either yes or no. By answering the questions, we can identify and name animals and sort them into right groups.